Hey guys, hope you are doing good. So today I'll be talking about how to connect your Android device over Wi-Fi using ADB commands. So before I proceed further for the demo, I would like to tell you this is my blog qahuma.blogspot.com. You can go there and have a look. I have already written a post regarding to this one. So let's proceed uh, further with the demo. So you can see this is uh, my blog uh, where I have written all the steps. So you can follow here or you can watch the video as well. So uh, I'll fire up the terminal. So so uh, before proceeding to running uh, ADB commands, I would like to tell you these are the prerequisites you must have into your PC so that your life will be easy. The first prerequisite is like you must have Android Home configured onto your PC so that uh, you can run the ADB command from anywhere or else you have to go to Android uh, SDK path and run the ADB command. If you don't know how to do that, you can click here. There is a video link uh, where you can uh, see how to configure ADB command. Second thing is like you must have USB debugging option enabled into your mobile phone. So how you can do that? You can go to developer option uh, into your uh, phone settings and you can enable the USB debugging from there. The third thing is like you must have a USB cable connected with your mobile phone and the laptop and this is required only for the uh, one time and after that you can run the below commands so let me uh, fire the command adb devices so you can see uh, one device is connected to this one uh, this laptop so it means my usb debugging option everything is working fine the second uh, command uh, is like you have to run the adb tcp option TCP IP and followed with port number so I'll be providing the port number here one so you can uh, put two also let me put two and it's restarting in TCP mode uh, 5002 now what you have to do is like you have to disconnect the USB cable from your uh, PC and you have to go to your uh, mobile phone settings and check for the IP address which is assigned to your uh, mobile phone. So you can go to settings about and status and you can see the IP address in your uh, mobile phone. And once you get the IP address, you can run this command adb connect, adb connect followed with IP address. and port number so port number 5002 and hit enter so it's connected to your uh, uh, mobile device now run adb devices command again so you can see uh, this is connected to this ip address earlier it was connected to this device now we have connected through wireless so it connected to through the ip address now run uh, some basic command uh, which executes on your device so one thing is like adb shell pm list packages so it will show all the packages or app which are installed into my phone So you can see this is working fine this is connected wirelessly and we, we can also see the IP address of the device so adb shell if config I'll pipe with grip symbol grip command inet so you can see the IP address right so this is the IP address and if you want to disconnect so you can do adb disconnect and the ip address to 5224120502 so it will disconnect it so if you see adb devices it will show nothing because nothing is connected because i have removed the usb cable so one more thing uh, which you have to uh, uh, make sure is like both your PC and the mobile phone should be connected to the same Wi-Fi network. It should not like it's 
one is connected to one uh, Wi-Fi network and the other one is connected to another Wi-Fi network. It will not work. And if you want to reconnect, so you can just reconnect using the same command. So a ADB devices, it will connect back. So, so that's it. Uh, hope you like this video. Uh, if you have any questions, please comment down into a comment section and uh, please uh, subscribe to my channel. Thank you.